members have realised and we as an association have realised that there are a number of key issues affecting the heart of our industry. We realised that using our support network, our resources and our rich knowledge base that our members possess, we can truly inspire a change within our industry for the better and enable our industry to remain a thriving payments ecosystem. We felt the need to look at the people volunteering on our projects and champion exactly what they've been doing. By doing this video series, we can bring to light the members that we truly call Payments Heroes. I was drawn to Project Rome really following my own challenges of trying to navigate and speaking to regulators, understanding from the schemes what the requirements were to have our own direct access at PaySafe. When I met Tony Craddock, um, Rich Wagner from APS, um, Mike Smith from Rayfalls and John Davis from Just Cashflow, I realised that actually I wasn't alone. There were many other companies also trying to navigate the space and I felt that joining forces with the EPA um, would give me the access that I needed to move forward on my own objectives. I think the biggest achievement of Project Rome has really been raising awareness of two areas. One, the lack of access to the UK banking infrastructure, which is pretty much um, only available via a couple of banks here in the UK and I think the other point was raising awareness around the lack of access to bank accounts across the industry. The value that Project Rome has added to the wider community um, has been really around the successful lobbying for access to a settlement account with the Bank of England. I think we've also been incredibly successful in raising awareness of the challenges that are faced across the industry in gaining access to bank accounts to service our businesses. And I think enabling um, small to medium sized companies that have faced challenges in gaining access a forum to come and discuss some of those challenges. Project Rome over the next 12 months will remain focused on bank account access and lobbying hard to try and resolve some of the challenges that are currently in the payment space that are impacting many of our members and we're also going to continue to um, work closely with the Bank of England on the framework that's just been announced to enable non-banks access to Bank of England settlement accounts so that will be our primary focus. If someone wanted to join an EPA project, I would say if you want to work with like-minded individuals, you're passionate about change in payments, and you want to work with what is essentially the only trade body in the UK that is really supporting the payments industry, then the EPA is for you. We've seen already that they've been able to tap into the heart of central government. They've had the endorsement of ministers. They've been able to engage with embassies all across the globe. They've been able to tap into the insight of the regulator and get the regulator to be incorporated into our community. 